has refused to pay protection money. If you see their vans, hijack them and bring them to one of our garages. Sounds good. I'll grab them if I see them. Hey, Lo Yao, take a look at what I have. Ah, oh, can you believe that price? Don't ask me how I keep it so low. Ah, you crash this one? Come see me again. I'll get you another one in less than 24 hours. Talking to? It's the dying old man, it's the chairman. Woman Bagala. Mama Shando. Wait, you're coming with me. Looks like you're gonna meet Uncle Po. The rest of you, wait here. Don't do anything until you hear from me. What's going on? You are staying here like I told you, and you are shutting the fuck up! Got it? Yeah, boss. Of course. Good. Let's go. Ice cream! Get your ice cream here! You're worried. You pissed off the wrong people, Wayne. Right? Look, at least we kept see you all alive. Yeah. That may be just what saves us. I'm gonna bump Uncle Paul's cup. Well, when that does it, it's not fair, you know? Look what I built. The night market. All of North Point, really. And Dog Eyes gets green. What was I supposed to do, huh, Lou? I mean, what's hang up? Just what you did. Look, you can't back down from that asshole. You and him got history, huh? Well, me too. Listen, Wayne. Anything, anything happens to me. You look after our people, okay? We're a... We're a family. Family has to stick together. Duke, Conroy, they're good guys. But they're not gonna be leaders. I know Conroy gives you shit, but you've proven yourself now. And they'll see it. Neither of you doesn't want to admit it. Do me a favor. Look after Peggy and my mom, too. This can be a 
tough business. The one thing we got going for us is each other. Brothers, you know. I know people use that word a lot. But it means something to me. And it should to you too. Not just that we're son on you. True brothers. But we look after each other. And we look after the people we love. Okay, Winston. See why Tommy really works for Big Smiley, not Dog Eyes. I keep hearing his name. Big Smiley is back in Dog Eyes, sure. That's where he gets the balls to come after me. Lee has a lot of power. Along with drugs, he's in the prostitution. Porn. Even sells women across the border into the rest of Asia. The whole thing is run like an industry. Very sleazy, but big money. Winston, we can't just walk in there. Not if it's as bad as you say. You don't have a lot of choice. It's the way it's done, Way. Besides, you can't hide from Uncle Poe. If he wants you dead, you're dead. And I'd rather see it coming, you know? You should be okay. But if I get my ass shot, do not... Do anything stupid, you hear me? Okay. Who gives a shit? Fuck off, Johnny. Hey, Winston. What's wrong? You look a little pale, man. That dog guy tells me you've been throwing your weight around. What happened? You guys used to be tight as shit. Is he here? Nah, he left a while ago. Without a scratch. Doesn't bode so well for the other parties involved. Go right in. Have fun. Uncle Paul. Ah, Winston. Come in. Sit down. Have some tea. And you, young man, must be way. Winston speaks very highly of you. Winston has been a good friend to me. I've tried to do right by him. I like the way you think. That's the attitude that makes us strong. Loyalty, discretion. Used to be more common. Winston says you're the one who made sure Siu Hua was not arrested. No, it was Winston's idea. He had to assert himself, assert his position. But he didn't want to inconvenience you in the process. Did he not? In any case, you did well. I want to show you my gratitude. Uncle Poe, there's really no need. Don't argue with me. Do you know Roland Ho? He has a business collecting debts. The other day he told me that he could use some help. It's uh, quite lucrative, you know. <laughs> Tell him I sent you. Winston won't mind in the slightest, will you? Thank you, Uncle. Winston, 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 relax. I know you were provoked. God damn it. I bet a thousand bucks I was going to be carrying you on a fucking body bag. Uncle Poe must like you. Uh, yeah, I don't think he has an opinion on me either way. All right. I tell you what, you get tired of spinning your wheels in the night market, give me a call. There's more to this business than strong arm and street vendors. Ricky, your name's Ricky, right? I appreciate the offer. You know, let me think about it and I'll get back to you. Take the car across the street. Give you a chance to see what it's like to be in the big time. Yeah, you all right? Uh-huh. Things are gonna be okay. There's gonna be work to do. A lot of work. Stay ready. I always am. Look, uh, in the meantime, I'm getting swamped with a sweaty crap. Let me need your help on a couple of things. Yeah? Yeah. I tell you, it's easier to be a wreck than a group. I'll stop by the restaurant when you're done there, okay? Got it.
Hey, rolling hoe? Who's asking? My name's Wei Shen. Ah, oh, Wei. You got friends in high places, my boy. I hear you and Winston have been making trouble with Dog Eyes. Dog Eyes has been asking for trouble. <laughs> I remember when I was like you. Always looking for a fight. Ready to kill anyone who so much as looked at me sideways. Here's a tip for you, kid. Don't take on a boss in your own triad, unless you know for a fact someone else is gonna back you up. Hierarchy is the only thing anyone cares about. Always have, always will. <laughs> Thanks for the advice, old timer. So, uh, when can we get to work? Okay, big man. Petsy Wing. Bad luck at Mahjong. You'll need this. Collect what she owes. See you later about some money. You're gonna pay up, you understand? <laughs> Shit, that's a lot of muscle. Like rolling home money, you gotta pay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I don't care if you're sorry. I care if you have the money. I, I don't, I'm sorry. Hey, stop saying that. Sorry. Look. The car. Who has drugs in the back? That should cover my debt. Don't hurt me. Best thing though, got a car loaded with dope. All right, what I have to do? 
bring it back here as soon as you can. Don't drive around in a stashed car any longer than you have to. Raymond. Shed. Finally. Where the hell have you been? Look, I... Uh... Do you have any idea what's going on? What happened at the warehouse? Raymond, do you ever actually read my reports? Your reports? All I have to do is read the goddamn newspapers. They're calling it a massacre. If it ever came out that the police were involved, we're dead. It won't. Well, you can't know that. You at least, you at least could have turned Siwa over to us. It would have helped our case. That would have put the entire operation at risk. What does Penju say? You know, he's not your handle, Way. I am. Well then fucking handle it, Raymond. Well, how'd you think this was gonna go down? Huh? Whatever it takes. You remember that? You wanted results. And you can't get them sitting behind a desk, nose in a rule book, with a stick up your ass. Look, Raymond. I am doing what needs to be done. No. No, you've crossed the line, Way. I'm gonna terminate this operation. You can't do that. Pendru won't allow it. Pendru may like to take chances. I don't. And you are dangerous. Fine. But before you go back to your office to try and pull the plug, go ahead and tell Pendru that I just met the chairman of the Sun on Yi. The chairman? <laughs> Wait, you're, you're just a foot soldier. Well, this foot soldier has just been marked for promotion because I made sure Suwa got out safely. It'll be in my report. And maybe this time you'll actually read it.